Welcome all. In this session, I am going to show you one of the useful tools for software testers that is Web Developer Form Filler. So what exactly is this tool and how it can be useful for the software testers? Let me explain. As software testers, we often come across some applications having some lengthy forms. While testing that forms, we may have to fill the form multiple times, okay? We cannot only fill one time and test the form, right? We have to test it multiple times. Every time you test the form, you need to fill the form, which will take a lot of time for you. But don't worry guys, there is a tool, a very good tool, which will save you a lot of time. You just need to fill the form once and next time onwards, this tool will fill the form for you. Let me now practically show you how to use this tool for filling the forms. Let's say there is an application, tutorialsninja.com slash demo. On this application, there is a register page. In this register account page, there is a form. So if I have to test this particular form, I have to fill it multiple times, right? For multiple test cases, I have to fill this form multiple times. But guys, as I already mentioned, you can use this tool known as Web Developer Form Filler to save your time. Let me now show you how to use the tool. So what we have to do is first, let's install this add-on guys, okay? First, let's install this Web Developer Form Filler. It is a Chrome browser add-on. So open any new tab in Chrome and search for Web Developer Form Filler like this, okay? Web Developer Form Filler. Search it, you'll get the search results. Web Developer Form Filler from chrome.google.com. Click on that, you'll be taken to the Google Chrome Web Store of this Web Developer Form Filler page. Click on Add to Chrome. Then click on Add Extension. And this extension will be added to your Chrome browser like this. So once you close it, uh, click on Extensions and then pin it so that you can directly access it. Now, once you once you install it, guys, just refresh the page, okay, where you want to use. Just refresh the page after installing so that it will work properly. Now, go to the page where you have the form. Let's say you are in the login page or some other page. Now go to the page where you have the form. Let's say the form is in register page, right? I'll click on the register. So you're taken to the register account page, which is having a form. When Now when you are in this page, guys, okay, just click on this add-on once to see if there are any errors. No, there are no errors. That's fine, guys. Now start filling the form, guys, okay? So let me give some details, Arun. Okay, I'll give my name, okay? First name, last name. I'm giving some email address, then, uh, uh, I'll give the telephone number, some telephone number, okay? Some telephone number. I'm giving some password, okay? Another password and selecting this checkbox option. Everything I have filled it up, right? This complete form, I filled it up. Now, what I have to do is once you fill, it, fill this particular form once, just click on this add on and say save this form, okay? You are saving this form with all these details. You are saving this particular form with all the details, guys. Just click on save form. You see, the form got saved with all the details you provided here. Fine. So that's it, guys. Nothing much. You don't have to do anything. Done. Now, let's say you navigated to another page. Okay. Login page. And if you click on this add-on, guys, uh, it will say that for this particular page, there are no forms saved. That's correct because we saved the form for the register page, right? So again, go back to the register account page. Now, click on this add-on. It will say that there is a form here. You see, a form is saved here, as you can see. If you go to the particular page in which you have saved the form, right? That form will be displayed in that particular page only. Okay, if you go to the login page, this form will not be displayed. That's what I mean to say. Now, as you can clearly see, this register account page form is not filled up, right? You see, all these fields are empty. So, but you saved the form already, right? In this add-on, you saved this form already. Click on this add-on and say restore, guys. The moment you say restore, all these fields will be filled up automatically for you. You don't have to manually type anything. Just click on restore, you see? whatever the details that you have saved while saving the form, right? That details got automatically added to your form, guys. So do you think this add-on is very useful, guys? Yes, this is very useful. It will save a lot of time. No matter how many times you are going to test this form, you just click on this, restore, you'll get all the details filled up automatically by this add-on. This will save. This will save a lot of time for you guys. So that's it about this session, guys. Hope you like this particular tool, which will save a lot of time for you. Thank you, guys. Bye.